It is well known that the laws of North Korea are very strict, actually, it is the most secretive country in the world, and if we want to describe the leader of North Korea, Kim Jong-un, the word dictator or tyrant is not enough to describe him, this terrorizes his people because of the many strange tyrannical rules imposed by the government. And despite what the world of freedoms has reached, the situation in North Korea is completely different, on the contrary, because the government imposes strict laws on the Korean people, of course, this is different from the strange behavior and decisions of the North Korean leader, welcome, I'm Allison, and in this episode, we'll talk about the five weirdest laws in North Korea. In light of the tremendous progress in the world of technology in general in many countries of the world, but life in North Korea does not follow the same pattern, the North Korean people only have three TV channels, and the state monitors them permanently, and they are forced to watch these three channels, and the government prohibited citizens from watching any foreign media materials other than the three national channels. It is known that a person who commits a crime in any country is arrested, and the punishment imposed by law is applied, but in North Korea they have reached the point that they legislate a law that some crimes that a person can commit will be punished by imprisonment of the person and his first-degree relatives for the same the punishment. In fact, computers and the internet are present in North Korea, but they are not like they are known around the world. It is a restricted private network bearing the name Baoning, and the number of websites on it is estimated at 5,500 sites. Of course, it is prohibited to use any of the international websites, and the operating system used by the devices there, known as Red Star, is similar to one of the MacBook operating systems, it is said that this system was designed because of the Korean leader's fondness for Apple products, as for the Wi-Fi feature, it is completely prohibited. If anyone wants to move his life to the capital of his country, all that will occupy his mind at that time is to provide housing and work, but the situation is different in North Korea, citizens do not have the right to decide to change residence to the capital, like any normal person. One of the strange laws of the Korean president is that only the most successful, most powerful and influential live in the capital which of course are hard-line people from the ruling party itself, which is considered the highest social class in the country. It is natural and known to all the people that anyone is able to choose the haircut he needs, but in North Korea the government has an objection to this matter, so the haircuts were chosen by the government for the citizens, and the government provided only 28 haircuts for men and women, and citizens can choose a haircut from these haircuts only. And if you think to deviate from these haircuts, this is considered a rebellion punishable by law, however, the North Korean president's haircut himself is not among the 28, and this is in order to remain a haircut, the leader is the only and unique in the whole country. And you, dear follower, what do you think of these strange and dictatorial laws that explicitly infringe on human personal freedom, and did you imagine that there is a country in the world today in which people live in this way, and do not forget to support us with the like button, subscribe and share the video with your friends.